second Saturday of bow archery. So uh, Kimberly and Kayla is on one lace. Garrett and Sadie are on another. And I'm back in the spot looking for blackjack. It's a little foggy this morning. It's starting to break up. I couldn't do an interview right when I first got here. It was so, fo so foggy. So been settled in for about 30, 45 minutes. Everybody made their stand good and safe. So going to get quiet, keep watching, and hopefully these bucks will move back through here. And hopefully Blackjack at least make an appearance. I've only got him on video or on my Camo Jojo Trace. I got him on Camo Jojo Trace the other day. But uh, he's a big eight-pointer. He's a huge eight-pointer for around here. So it's kind of my number one buck that I'd like to take this year out of my two. So anyway, we'll see. Y'all stay tuned. Okay, well that was a great morning, it's 10 o'clock. Uh, I'm packing up now, just got the news that Sadie shot a buck. She's, they, her and Garrett said it sounded like a good hit and he ran downhill. So we're gonna go see what we can do. Um, I don't know what the shot's like, it was a little long of a shot, but we're gonna go over there, it's her first buck. So we're gonna take what crew we've got over there and see if we can find it, see what the blood looks like and uh, go from there. So, Tickle death for Sadie and Garrett. Uh, hope everything goes well. So fingers crossed you hang on, hang with us. Yeah. So he was down here. He was over there. So we've made it over here to Garrett and Sadie. We're not 100% sure about the shot. So Miss Sadie's the one that was the shooter. Garrett was helping her watch, uh, help walking her through it. And Kimberly, I went and picked her up. So we've got our crew here. This is all the crew that could come. So we're going to ease down here and look at the arrow. And then they've got a pretty good funny story about it. And y'all could relate. So. Fingers crossed, we get one in him, he's down, and we make this as ethical as possible. So we're gonna move on down here and check it out. Yeah, it's a gut shot. He's still alive. Okay, let's see if we can make a move on. Get that, get that arrow in it. Shoot him 
right in front of the rear head into his vitals if you can. And don't shoot if you don't feel, if you feel, you know, like you're going out to shake or something, that's fine. I was really nervous. I just didn't want to shoot him in the wrong spot. Thank you. I'm so That's excited. ethical. That's ethical, ain't it, Kim? Yeah. Look here, guys. Yeah, he's putting out some blood right here. Let's give him a second for letting it Well, congratulations to Sadie. That's her first deer. Uh, and it's a good buck from what we can tell. Uh, the shot was quartering and I think it was one lung out the gut, so I only had one exit, but she put it right where I want. I told her to put it, and she's practiced with her bow. She's comfortable with it. So we're gonna go ahead and let them tell you the story. I've gotta get a hold of the neighbor and uh, make sure that I can cross his fence to drag this deer back over it. So I'll let them tell you the story. All right, where do we start? So what, how did this day go? Well, we got in the stand probably, what, 6.30? 6 6.30, On yeah. the dot. Mm -hmm. uh, sat for about an hour and a half, maybe two, and a pair of does came across. One really small, one one pretty big. He ragged me since I, I didn't shoot yeah, one. Yeah, she ain't shot her first deer he yet. She's got a bow in her hand. She said the first year she wouldn't shoot her dog. Yeah. Was 20 yards away from the stand. <laughs> so I harped her for a little bit. She, she kind of got aggravated. <laughs> and then, uh, Made me feel bad. For probably, what, another 30, 45 minutes went yeah. by? Two more, two bucks came across. One, one looked a little older, and the other one was young, just tailing him. And uh, you could tell he was like picking on him a little bit too, playing. With I him. seen him run right into the woods, down at the bottom of the yeah. field. They were playing. They crossed across. The I didn't get to see points on. I don't know what they were, but um, she wanted to take the shot on the first one, and I'll let you take it. And my arrow wasn't pushed all the way back so my safety wouldn't come up and Garrett was trying to help me and he completely blocked the scope so they went on I was furious I was ready to go we were about to pack up and go and I was sitting there fuming and then Garrett said there's one and we seen him and I thought it was a doe so I was like not even gonna shoot her but then I looked through my scope and I seen it was a buck and he got he started to go away from us and then he, I was like, he's going to come right through those trees, but if I don't get him then, he's going to be gone forever. So I, I just took the shot. and I got the yardage on it. I'm telling you, that deer was 50 yards away at yeah. least. I was like, that's a risky shot. but I used my 50, but I aimed a little low. and it Aimed a little high. It actually, high. it looks to me like it hit right where it should have. So he, if he, even if he ducked, it caught him where he needed to. It's just a quarter was the problem. It was the opposite yeah. quarter. It wasn't deep enough in the shoulder. But the deal is is we come up with a game plan to get down here, come down this road bed and get in here. And we was all able to sneak here. And Kim actually seen him first yep. and thought he was dead. And mm -hmm. she said, what would you pay me for a buck? And then he, <laughs> he raised his head. She's like, everybody be quiet. <laughs> Kimberly on the track with us. So that, 
I don't know if Buck fever hit her like it should have because she was so worked up over missing that one. I heard drilling. She's yeah. already pissed off. She yeah. was trying to, she was leaning over me trying to get a shot on that. I think he was a five pointer. Because I had to lean all the way over him yeah. just to shoot him. And then when I seen the safety was on, I was like, your safety's on. She was like, no, it's not. <laughs> so, and then I'm, I know her safety's on. So I'm trying to push her bolt back in so I can get it on a uh, fire and she's, God, she got upset. I did, <laughs> but it paid off. Yeah. Well, everything I'm, happens for a reason. I have to say, I'm proud of it. For one, you listen to everything we said, and two, y'all watching the deer to get some landmarks and take pictures. Y'all, you know, that's a, uh, you know, the, every one of these hunts is a learning step, ain't it, Kim? Mm -hmm. And this right here, I hope, you know, I'm sure y'all learned something from it. So, I'm gonna make a quick phone call and get the the guy on this property and see if he don't care if we just crawl under the fence and get it. I know he probably won't, but it's always the right thing to do. It's just uh, integrity, not just crawling across somebody's fence. So I'll give him a call and uh, we'll retrieve him and get some pictures. So y'all hang on. Yeah, he's gone. All right, grab him antlers. That's your first buck, first deer ever. Good job, Sadie. He's an eight. First deer. First deer. First, first deer. First deer. Period. First deer with a crossbow. Yeah. She made that up. She's used that road good. Yep. She shot this one with a uh, rogue, a Barnett rogue, mm -hmm. with head hunter arrows, twenty inch, and uh, trip hand rage broadheads or crossbow broadheads. So, but uh, they did the number. I can see where the exit come out here in the back. Yeah. So he was quarter and two. But the shot placement was good, real good. What do you think? Pretty good deer. <laughs> Who's that, Papa? He's got boots on. What he likes is wants to get in the car. The Jeep. Is that a deer? You want to touch him? Pat, pat, pat. Pat, pat, pat. Wow. What do you think about Mama getting that deer, bro? Bro. What do you think about your Mama getting that deer? Where's the deer? Say woo woo. Where's your nose? He's like, I'm confused. There's too many questions at once. <laughs> he don't know where the deer's at. <laughs> I can't see it. What do you think, buddy? Yeah. Nana riding you around your little hot rod with a... Whoop, lost a crop. Uh -oh. <sighs> well, this turned out to be an awesome morning. Um, we went and showed everybody. Sadie's first deer. We're proud of her. She did good. She followed up with it. Um, Garrett got to experience it. Garrett's goal was for her not to kill one unless he was with her. And so he's been there and said he's got one under a belt. Now it's Garrett's turn. Briar got involved. I got to put a little video in here of him. And we got Kimberly here. We all, that was an interesting track, wasn't it? So from all of us at Pine Life, we appreciate y'all watching. Congratulations once again to Miss Sadie. And you'll be seeing more of her and Garrett on the, uh, on the channel. And as always, God bless. We'll see you on the next video. See ya.